Matt Linehan, Boxing Social, in association with Empire Fight Store and Forged Irish Stout. Always a pleasure to be joined by Billy Nelson. Billy, look, Lewis Crocker, Tyrone McKenna, what an incredible fight. Originally supposed to be a main event until Michael Conlon came back. That's what everyone's talking about this week. Whenever I go, they talk, touch on the main event and then it's like, what about that undercard fight? Um, how excited are you for Lewis to get such a big fight on a big stage? No, of course, it's a, it's a, great, a great platform for, for Lewis to showcase his skills. Uh, people are saying it's a 50-50, it's nothing of the kind. Uh, Lewis Crocker's a huge, punching, skillful welterweight. That's the most important word in this fight. He is a welterweight and a big, big welterweight coming up against a guy that's a, that's a light welterweight who's been dropped and stopped by light welterweights and lightweights. He says he's, nev he says he's never... Uh, uh, Progress the hardest punch he's ever ever faced. I'm going to ask you. I'm going to ask him that same question at ten o'clock Saturday night. You wholeheartedly believe he gets Tyrone out of there this Saturday? Undoubtedly. How much of a special talent is Lewis Crocker? This is his moment now where he gets um, a chance at a name. When obviously we've seen what he's done against um, his opponents coming up, but now this is a guy who has been in there, with, uh, regardless win, lose or draw. He's been in there with tough opponents. Um, but he's lost. He has, and that's what Lu that's what Lewis said to me. Um, how do you think this could go early on Saturday, or do you think this could get dragged late? How 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 do you see it in your mind as a trainer? As I said, for for the first bell to the last bell, Lewis could knock him out with a left hand to the head, right hand to the head, left to the body, or right to the body. He's got that that freakish power. He can he can he can he can stop him in any manner. It really, it all depends what he sees and when he delivers that shot. But he will deliver that shot. You've trained, obviously, a lot of fighters over the years. Pound for pound, is he the hardest puncher you've had? And, oh, without a doubt, far, far and away the hardest puncher. Far and away. Listen, listen. Any sparring partner, that, the last five weeks of sparring, everybody that sparred with him, he's, he's either stopped him or dropped him. Is he one of the... Gonna, one, is he, one, one guy said to me when he got hit with a shot, he says, I felt a tremor going through my body. Wow, well, look, if you're unsure if you're going to tune in on Saturday, just listen to these words, and Lewis Crocker, Tyron McKenna, it's going to be box office, what, regardless of what happens in there on Saturday night. Um, Martin Bacoli, have we got any sort of update on what the big man's doing next? He had a terrific performance in Saudi. I know he had an issue with, I think he said to me, or someone, a swallowed a, a swallowed a wasp. No wonder his interview was... Bit... He lost his voice the following week for a couple of days. Uh, it was quite quite concerning. But uh, they had a back injury going out of fight. No, uh, never ran at all for basically a full camp. Uh, hence he was £299, which wasn't nice to see, but he, he, wanted, to, he wanted to showcase his skill on, it, on that platform and look what he'd done, an unfit, relatively unfit, Martin Bacoli, mm -hmm. look what he'd done to tack him. So look what, I think, think when I've got him fit uh, for February, when I, hopefully he'll be out in February again, when he's fit, lighter, £30 lighter, what's he going to be like? What type of opponent are we looking at? What are the names that you want to stick him in with? Uh, you, is, is there one that's been made and we just can't announce it yet or where are we at? More or less. Any hints, any clues? No, 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 not yet. Has he become World Heavyweight Champion in your eyes? In 2024, given the opportunity, he'll be, he'll be the world champion. Because he's already, I mean, he'll beat Usyk. Usyk knows that he'll beat him. You know, he's, he knows how he beat Usyk. Usyk knows that. I mean, we're full of what a fight Usyk is. But look, look when we were over in uh, rehab, the Alec Krasnick and he uh, yeah, yeah. uh, 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 jumped in an interview and says this guy's going to be next world champion because they know how good he is. You just haven't seen the best of Martin Bacoli yet. But he's fit. Well, let's get him fit. Um, the other fight's on the 23rd card. And what do you make of Wilder Joseph Parker? Listen, I'd love Joseph Parker to win that fight. I just think it's a very, very hard fight for him, isn't it? Tough fight, obviously. Wilder carries that one punch. Well, that's all the big men do, but he's. Um, he's a freakish, he has freakish power. For the, for a size for you know for sixteen stone, Wilder Bacola. Uh, well, I was offered it. I was offered it, and we said yes. But he's obviously he's, he's selected Joseph Parker. Well, look, let's see. Um, I think it's going to be it's going to be a cracking card on the twenty third, and we look forward to seeing Martin get back out February, and hopefully when you f you're allowed to let us know who he's fighting, and we can reveal the news. And also, also Sultan Zorbek will be out in yep. February. What a fantastic talent is. I mean, what a fight. That, I mean, 
Jamie, Jamie, Jamie Conlon versus and, and uh, McGill on, on Saturday. There's a fight. There's a winner. Fight, fight Sultan Zorbeck. Also, uh, Lee McGregor will be returning, hopefully, around about February after that. Uh, How is Lee? I, 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 uh, a grade one tear on his arm, but it's getting better now. He should have been fighting tomorrow night, right. which would have caused me a bit of hassle, bolting here, bolting here. But unfortunately for him, he's, he's injured, but he'll, he'll bounce back. He was starting to look excellent in the gym. I'm heartbroken for him. No. He's had a lot of bad luck, can Lee McGregor, the past 18, 24 months with injuries and things happen outside the ring. Um, how much for next year is it about just getting him back on track and getting him firing again? He'll be right up there next year because he's got a great, a great determination to do well and we've changed his style and he's looking so, so much better fighter now. Yeah. I look forward to seeing the return of Lee McGregor and more immediate future. We look forward to seeing this fight on Saturday, Lewis Crocker, um, one of Ireland's, you know, Talent coming through, but I think he's going to be propelled into everybody's eyes on Saturday night. He's a what is this saying? Uh, something down a rough diamond. Yeah. And he's start, he's going to get polished on Saturday night. <laughs> Billy, I appreciate your time. Thanks for talking Thanks to Boxing Social. Cheers.